the girls' 800 meters gets underway. So from the outside, it's the pole, Alicia Storch. In lane seven, in lane seven France. representing France, nice Rakasan. Looked impressive, looked finishing six, speed for the young Frenchman. On her inside, second fastest woman in this competition, Sophie O'Sullivan. A very impressive semi final winner, Gail de Koenig from Sweden, improving her personal best last night. Natalia Lashowska of Poland. And the fastest woman in the field, Keely Hodgkinson, took out her semi final very quickly and perhaps paid the price. I wonder if she's going to adopt the same tactics. On Hodgkinson's inside, it's Sofia Volkmer of Germany. And on the inside, Svetlana Shushuk of Ukraine. Well, this could be a very, very interesting race. Hodgkinson, the fastest in Europe this year in the, amongst these entrants. O'Sullivan looks good, so does De Koenig. Hodgkinson once again has gone out very quick indeed. De Koenig up on her shoulder. Hodgkinson heads for the inside. She likes to lead from the front, she likes to really throw down the gauntlet and make everybody else suffer. Koenig, though, keeping her in her sight. She's right up on her shoulder. A slightly ungainly pole. Alicia Storch just behind her. Small figure, not difficult to recognize. And of course, Ujak and O'Sullivan just behind Storch. Once again, it's Hodgkinson leading the way with a very fast first lap. Looking around at each other, Rakasan and Lachowska struggling at the moment. So it's Hodgkinson, 62-14. That is a very, very quick race. Very quick 400 meters. So 300 meters to go, and it's still Hodgkinson with the Koenig out on her shoulder. Now O'Sullivan coming round the outside. Slightly shorter pattering style of O'Sullivan. Edging past Stoj, now getting up on the shoulder of De Koenig. Well, Hodgkinson finding another gear though, she's not going to let O'Sullivan go. 200 metres to go, and Hodgkinson now starting to pull away, really starting to motor the diminutive Britain. O'Sullivan in second place, De Koenig in third. Hodgkinson working hard now, I think she can taste that gold medal, O'Sullivan doing very well behind her, holding off De Koenig, it was so impressive. Rakasan comes from a long, long way back over the course of the last 200 metres, but it's going to be Kelly Hodgkinson, 2.04.86, another gold medal for Britain, just outside her personal best, and a championship record for Keely Hodgkinson. O'Sullivan gets the silver, and the Koenig of Sweden, the bronze. Rakasan just left it all far too late to get into a medal position. Well, O'Sullivan absolutely delighted with her performance. Her mum, Sonia O'Sullivan, former world champion in the crowd, helped us out with a bit of commentary yesterday. Koenig, well, looks a bit disappointed. She had a cracking run in the semi-final. That 
did go to pre-championship form. These were the one, two, three amongst the entrants. Well, Keely Hodgkinson decided on her tactics and bravely managed to, as so often many athletes say, execute and deliver. Championship record 20484 for Keely Hodgkinson. Sophia O'Sullivan just a fraction outside her personal best, but she won't mind. She'll be on the podium as the silver medalist. And Gail de Koenig, Sweden, again, just a fraction outside her personal best, and she'll take the bronze.